If you're looking for your next drama to binge, the new BritBox series, The Confessions of Franny Langton, mixes a murder mystery with a forbidden love for a story that keeps viewers on the edge of their seats. Joining us now are star Carla Simone Spent and creator Sarah Collins with more on this intense story. Ladies, welcome to ISF. Hi, thanks for having us. This show, Sara, is based on your best-selling novel. I mean, what is it like seeing your work come to life on the small screen? Oh, absolutely surreal. I keep having to pinch myself. Um, you know, I it's a one in a million kind of thing to have a novel published, let alone having that novel adapted for screen. But I have to say I'm really proud of what we've done. You know, proud in particular that, as I keep saying, we have put a Jamaican woman in Jane Austen territory. That was really important for me. It's kind of a gift to my sort of younger self who grew up obsessed with period dramas and historical romance and just never saw or someone like this, a black woman, intelligent, passionate, kind of trying to own her space in a context where society says she doesn't matter and she has no voice. So I'm really proud of it. This story is timeless and also timely. Carla Simone, for those who are new to the story, explain the premise. So it follows the story of Franny Langton, who I play. And Franny's been accused of double murder, um, accusing um, of killing the love of her life and her lover's husband. And that's how the show starts out. So it goes, starts with a bang. And um, Franny doesn't believe that she's done it. So we're kind of following her journey of discovering whether she did do it or not, because she can't quite remember. Um, she was quite um, high on this drug at the time called laudanum um, that they took in the 1800s and it messed with her memory. So she's trying to piece together that night. I, I, again, <laughs> I think this is so timely and it's so indicative of how people find love and are in love in the world now. Uh, Carla, did you read this story before you took on the role? Were, were you aware or or, or um, a fan of it? I, I hadn't read the novel. Um, I read the novel after get, um, getting the role. I read a, a couple of pages whilst I was still auditioning. It was quite quick, the process of me getting um, Franny, to be honest. Um, I had that one, so I had, um, you know, I, I knew what was happening to her and they had the synopsis of the other episodes. Um, so yeah, when I read the novel, I was like, I just sat there like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, when I got the script, I was just really, really shocked and really like amazed and happy and excited that this was a Jamaican woman being written in a period drama. My family's Jamaican as well. So it, it really just resonated with me. And I just was like, I really, really need to be a part of this. Um, it, it's unheard of, it's, it's brand new. And yes, I was written something really fresh and exciting. I'm just really grateful to be a part of it. Sarah, Carla, thank you so much for your time with us tonight. <laughs> thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank you. Thanks, <laughs> 